we had an exciting mail day. Mail call. Yeah. Roll call. Roll call, but like, mail call works too. Mail, what do they say? Like mail time. Mail time, mail mm. time, mail time. I won't do the whole song, but you get it. It's blue okay. Mullet and Jeffel, mail time. Oh my god. We got another package from Pixie Beauty, you guys. And look at this you cute ass it. envelope. Magnetic box that's made to look like an envelope. It says to Pixie Lovely. And then the other side says, what color will you create with a lip and, in it? And, you're like, and we're like, hmm? it's gonna be lipstick. What does that right? even mean? And then you open it up, and it's honestly just whoa! <laughs> it's eleven liquid lipsticks. Oh my god! Can you even believe it? I'm upset. We're not wearing one right now. We're, we're gonna swatch them, aren't we? Yes, we um, have to. I was just gonna like walk my arm yeah okay. so we're going to show you swatches of all the lipsticks they are called the matte last liquid lip infused with rosehip oil this long word liquid liquid lip sets to a matte veil for full on color while keeping lips hydrated and i saw these on instagram the other day and i was like these colors are stunning mm -hmm. the formula is super opaque it looks creamy it looks rich we need these and then yeah. lo and behold yesterday on my porch there they were <laughs> yes and the other really fun exciting thing which i mean this is already fun and exciting. We didn't, we weren't expecting it. No. It's such a surprise. Is that they are asking us to create our own shade. Yes. And they've provided us with all of the necessary tools to mix together a custom our time of the month shade and then send it back to them. Yes. And if they pick it, we are going to California. <laughs> So we're imagine? going to California. Yes, absolutely. We're it's not if win. we're going to California. We are going to California. They because sent this little pre-postage uh, package for us to put our color in and send it off in the mail. And uh, did we get to name it? Oh, you have to be able to. Fill the empty in it, send it back using the bread envelope. Post a video image of uh, you mixing. Okay. Post on IG. No. We can we can give it a name though. We can name oh, it in our video. Oh, we have to name it. That's the fun part. Our dream in life is to be like nail polish namers. Exactly. Cosmetics namers. Okay, so we're gonna swatch them all for you. Ooh. Oh, I love the packaging. Oh, I guess we should show you one up close. So this is what the packaging looks like. It's a traditional acrylic, you know, rectangle. It has a doe foot applicator. And it is a an doe angle. foot applicator, yeah, angled that comes to a point. So you can get that lip line. You can get your lip line really well. So this is what the applicator looks like. It's really convenient and it's slanted. Helps you really get in the corners of your lips. Smell, oh, oh my God, it smells like a six lit. Do you know what a six lit is? Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, it's like orange. Yeah. So we have swatched all the colors on our arms and I will say the smell is great. They're very opaque. They're very creamy. They have not yet dried. Yeah, I'm gonna like wait for mine to dry because they look a little, like some of them look a little um, splotchy. Mm -hmm. And I think it's because they haven't dried yet. But also I do think what I put on my arm is probably a little bit thicker than what I would put on my mouth Absolutely. because I don't have like the rubbing, um, you know, and it just sits longer. And I'm sorry, but my arms are a little hairy, so you're gonna see some hairs in there. Oh my God, everybody's got hairy arms. No. Okay, so from left to right, we have Au Natural. And then Fair Beauty. Fair Beauty. Matte Beige. Matte Beige. Pastel Petal. Pastel Petal. And Really Rose. Really Rose. And then Evening Rose. Evening Rose. So I will say all of those- These are the same, pretty much. I think some of them has have very subtle differences, but if you look at where you start and where you end, mm -hmm. they're very different. Yes, I think they're all very wearable. I will say this one is a bit orange. I don't think Kaylin or myself would gravitate toward that kind of a color. But from like here over, I'd say we're in pretty good territory. I think that first one, if you have any sort of golden tone to your skin, then that's gonna really work for you. Um, but I think because we're both so fair, that yeah. orange ends up washing us out and bringing out sort of like the blue tones. And I look sickly and my teeth look yellow. <laughs> yeah. But I think um, we have another friend who manages to take, seems to always take any of the lipsticks that we get rid of that skew on the orange side, yeah. and she looks beautiful in them. So, like Caitlin, I think I did this watch is a little thick because they're a tiny bit tacky still. Peony pink, prettiest pink. We've got orange red, real red, and berry boost. Yeah, so I think 
for me, I think Berry, Berry Boost ends up coming the most so magenta. It's so translucent. I, I thought that was going to be like but I wonder, blood. Yeah, I thought it was going to be really dark, but I'm wondering if it's because I put it on thinner than all the others. Like if you know, it, I think it's the thinnest of the formulas. It, does, it looks a little bit more watery. Um, and so I think, yeah, I think it doesn't come out as a, yeah, bloody looking. That's not the right word. Like wine. It doesn't come out as whiny as okay. we thought. But yeah, so I can't wait to put them on my mouth. They're definitely matte. They are matte. They are not glossy. They are not shiny. See, that one is still wet. That's the thing is when I touch, like when I touch it's a little them, sticky. it's tacky. But when I touch them, nothing comes out on my finger. I think if I smeared them, mm -hmm. they would smear. But I think, um, I think they're tr like they're transferring. I don't think they're going to. So we're going to wear them throughout the next week and we'll do check-ins on Insta stories. So if you don't follow us on Instagram, it's just our time of the month mm -hmm. and we Insta story every day. And this is something that we would definitely update on there. Yeah. Um, because I want to know if it's coming off of my drinking glass or mm -hmm. if it's wearing away weird when I'm eating a meal, we'll share all those details there. Mm -hmm. And I will say, I mean, this is very scientific, but I have a beer can here, but it's wet on the bottom. It's wet on the bottom, but I mean, that. It might be wet on the lip when you drink from it. So I'm going to dry it a little bit and I'm just going to press oh, it. I'm getting nothing. So I'm not getting any transfer onto a can. That doesn't mean it wouldn't transfer onto a glass. Let me kiss my husband. My, like, come here. Come here. <laughs> actually, that would be a good test. Is it kissable? Like, put one on and then kiss Mike. You can kiss yeah. your own arm. I would rather kiss a man. Like sick I mean, but then you have to come up in the basement and grumble about it. <laughs> You're so right. But so I I am really excited about these. Yeah, I love Pixie products. But yes, yeah, so, so we will report back. I'm sure we will be making a video coming yeah. up soon of us creating our own shade. Yeah, that's so fun. It'd be like scientists. If you have name suggestions for us, please submit below. But yeah, if you do, I mean if you do, if you have because it'd be kind of fun. Pixie, if it was like, related to our time of the month, but wasn't our time of the month. I love the packaging. I love it because you can see the color. That's this important. is the actual color. It's not a swatch. And I do like the applicator. Mm -hmm. I did not like the Smashbox one because I hated that formula. But this seems easier to more apply. More malleable. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like I can actually work with it. So. Yeah. I'm excited. So we will report back and we're going to go try and take it off and see how easily it comes off. Oh wow, we really fucked this up, didn't we? I, who I knew? This. Like, who knew that there was like a whole technique who to knew? like where to swatch it so that when you do this. But for a photo, I go like if here. I took a photo. Okay. So we hope you liked this video. Like and subscribe. Like and thumbs up. Yeah. Comment. <gasps> comment. Please, we love it. We really yeah. want you to comment. We want to hear from you. That's the best part. Like, if, if you've tried these, let us know. Um, we're all about an affordable lip item excellent these are $14 and you know we love affordable makeup it's not $8 but it's certainly not $34 like Charlotte Tilbury hello which is what I'm wearing now right or the or Stila which is our one of our favorite liquid lip formulas mm -hmm. that's or NARS yeah I mean so I think it's really really great yeah. that they're coming they're coming out with a formula that is super wearable and then also super affordable yeah. so again here are all the colors get your hands on them they're available now you can buy them on pixie website you can also buy them at Target and we're gonna create our own lipstick. I'm really excited. Yes, so excited. This is we're gonna win. Okay, speaking of which, while we didn't wear them on our mouth today, what are you wearing on your mouth now? Oh, I'm, I already said it. I'm wearing the um, Charlotte Tilbury and Pillow Talk. So I am cheating you guys. I am wearing the NARS Liquid Lip in American Woman. And then I topped it with a little Bite Beauty Mousse Bouche Liquid Liquified Lip in Ch Chutney. I knew that. Yeah. I knew that's what you were gonna say. So, we hope you're having a great day, a great night, a great morning. And we will see you next Tuesday. Hi, this is the first check-in for the Pixie by Petra Matte Last Liquid Lip. This is the shade Really Rose. I put it on about 7.30. It's 8.30 a.m. now, so I've had it on for about an hour. Um, dried, very matte, but comfortable. It was a little tricky to apply because the applicator, while it's pointy and precise, is extremely flexible. So the second you place it on your lips, you have to have a lot of control immediately. Um, it is transfer proof. 
uh, which is a huge win for me. I haven't eaten or drank anything yet, but I'm getting ready to eat breakfast, so I will do another check-in afterwards. Good afternoon. This is check-in number two. Uh, it is 3.30 p.m., so I've had this lipstick on for eight hours, exactly, and I promise, Scal's Honor, I haven't touched up one single time. Um, I've eaten two meals, several snacks, I've drank coffee and water all day, and I think it's holding up really, really great. I will say in the, in the corners, it's wearing away a little bit, um, but it's, it's not doing that really <laughs> unflattering like butthole lip thing on the inside of your lips. Um, I, I will say I didn't do like the best application this morning because getting used to the applicator was a little tricky, but I think wear time, comfortability, all 10 out of 10, really loving them. I'm gonna wear a different shade tomorrow and I'll do more check-ins like this, but um, I'm really happy with it. For $14, you can't beat that, so. Stay tuned for the next shade. Good morning. This is day two with the Pixie Matte Last Liquid Lip. Today I'm wearing the shade Evening Rose. Uh, it is raining and storming really bad outside, so the lighting in here is not very accurate. Um, it does appear a little bit more brown on camera right now, but in theory, in real life, it's definitely a more mauve shade. I would describe it almost as like a deeper patina by Stila, which is one of mine and Caitlin's very favorite liquid lips. Uh, this one went on easier because I knew how to work with the applicator. As I stated before, it is a little bit tricky because it's so flexible. So uh, I did not use a lip liner. This is just how it applied, uh, but I really love this shade. Very comfortable, doesn't, no transfer, like none, none at all. That's insane. Um, I was really pleased with how it performed the other day, but wanted to give another color a try. And again, sorry about the lighting, but I just wanted to show you, you know, how this looks. You know, everything can look different swatched on our arm, but on our lips, it's a totally different story. 